So this is how to uh, um, access the sleep data on a Fisher & Paykel Icon Primo Plus. Uh, just press the and hold the start button and you hold it in it's for about sort of somewhere between 7 and 10 seconds and the display will light up and it's straight into the sleep data menu. So the first figure that you get is referring to the number of hours of data that there is and if we turn the dial you can see that we've moved the little circle around to the next dot and the number on the screen is the average hours of use per night and the little 30 and moon means that that's an average over 30 nights if i press the button once that gives me the average over seven moons or seven nights if i press the button again it gives me a single moon and that was how many hours the machine was used for last night if i turn the dial again to the next setting i get the percentage of nights that the machine was used for more than four hours Again, that's over 30 nights, 7 nights, or last night. Oh, sorry, 30 nights or 7 nights. Of course, you don't get an average for a single night. The next setting tells us the number of uh, nights, moons, that the machine's been used. So in this case, it's been used for 300 nights. And then if we turn the dial again, we get a checksum, which has got this little key icon. Uh, and that's a number that can be used to corroborate the, uh, the other figures. And if we turn the dial to the next setting, this is the one that's of most interest to the clinics. This is the apnea hypopnea index, or the number of times that the machine's detected pauses in the breathing. And again, it's averaged over 30 moons or 30 nights for the first figure. Press the button, we get uh, the average over 7 nights. Press the button again and we get what happened last night. So in this particular case, this chap has complex sleep apnea. Uh, he's averaging uh, about 34 times an hour that the machine is detecting uh, him taking longer than 10 seconds between each breath. Uh, if we turn the dial again, we get the uh, the leak from uh, the mask in litres per minute. Again, averaged over 30 nights, 7 nights, and last night. Uh, that figure should be generally below 42 or thereabouts litres per minute. There's always a little bit of uh, controlled leak flushing the hose, and that's what the, the figure is referring to at the moment. The next setting is the pressure that the machine is set for, and the last figure is the uh, number of times that the machine has detected uh, awakenings if the sense awake feature is activated. In this particular case, the sense awake is not activated, and so the number is zero. And then to get back to your main menu, turn the dial to the very top of the screen, the little return arrow, if we press the button, it takes you back out to the, uh, the start screen again. And that's how you read off the data, the sleep data, a manual read. Of course, you can always also use the info USB stick to send the data directly to the clinic uh, in a bit more detail than we get off the screen. That's it. That's how it works.